Hello, everyone. It's Steve with Aptera Owners Club. Um, do you guys remember these pictures of the Gamma um, solar hood? Uh, these, the solar cells on here showed some delamination um, of the encapsulation of the solar panel. And we were a little bit worried about that, the, these areas here. And then that was more evident in the uh, video that we saw where you see you see the delamination here and here and here all over the place. And um, we were a little worried about that. And you can see it more clearly over here. Well, now um, I was perusing Steve Fambro's LinkedIn feed and he has an explanation of what happened there. And uh, I, I just uh, happened to notice it. Someone pointed it out to us on, this, on the Discord channel. And so I checked it out. And here's, here's what they said. Uh, some guy named John Reeves says, also, did you guys figure out how to make the solar panels not delaminate after just a few days in the sun? The gamma solar panel that was activated looked horrible. And see, Steve Fambro says, hi, John, good eye and fair point. The backstory on that is I moved the goalposts on the team and put them in a situation where they had to rush to make a non-production panel. That's on me. You see, Gamma was never supposed to have a fully functional solar, but we asked the team to make it happen with little notice, and they did. They needed a new tool for the non-production dimension panel and only had a day or two to tune the delamination process for the new tool. The team warned us about delamination. It was a risk we took to have a fully functioning solar on Gamma for the event. We have many, many perfect panels that have gone through accelerated testing for over 15 year equivalent if you're ever in the area and want to see. Okay, so that's good to know. Um, so I guess what they wanted is they just wanted um, solar functioning for the fully charged show. And uh, they they asked the team to just m make a panel really, really fast and put it on there. And um, they so they they told them, hey, if we do this, it's going to delaminate and not look good. But they said, go ahead, let's just do it. Let's risk it. And they did. And, uh, and, for, and uh, it did delaminate, as they said. But they said they have many, many perfect panels that have gone through accelerated life testing for over 15 year equivalent. If you're ever in the area, want to see, OK, well, I'm if I ever go down there. Um, I, so I was thinking about going down there um, to drive the gamma around, but I think it's now maybe not that worthwhile to drive gamma since since now we have delta. Maybe we should just wait until delta is made um, before we go down there. But anyway, if we go down there, we I definitely want to see the uh, solar panels um, up close. That that'll be great. And it looks like Steve Ambrose uh, offering to let people see it. So that sounds good. Anyway, that is the story. Um, they, they kind of were asked to rush out a panel. They said, the engineer said that it was going to delaminate and it did, it did do that at least in small areas, but they have many, many perfect panels that have undergone the accelerated life testing for over 15 years. So that is uh, extremely good news. And so now we have the backstory on, on, on this. Okay. Well, um, hopefully that, uh, makes us all feel better. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks, as always, to our supporting members. Have a great day, everyone.